this is Vivian. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to learn 3 table but 11 to 20. So see I have written 1 time, 2 time, 3 times here. And I have some numbers written 11 to 20 3 times and I have got some pebbles here. So let us start. You see there are 10 in group 1, 10 in group 2, 10 in group 3. I am going to add 1 to each group. 1 to group 1, 1 one more to group 2 and one more to group 3. See, I am going to use these cards to represent. There are 11 in group 1, 11 in group 2 and 11 in group 3. See, so let us see. When there are 3 11s, meaning 3 times 11. So, we write it like this. 3 times 11 equal to see 11 plus 11 plus 11 10 plus 1 plus 10 plus 1 plus 10 plus 1 see 10 plus 10 plus 10 equal to 30. 1 plus 1 plus 1 that equals to 3. So 30 plus 3 equal to 33. So there are 33 pebbles. 3 times 11 equal to 33. So now let's do 12. But before that I want to tell you a fact. You see I am going to make everything into 3. See, this here. Mm, that goes like that. That goes like that. That goes like that. See? There I took everything as three. See, I took everything as three. See, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. See, there are eleven. See, there are three. In each group, but there are eleven. So three times eleven times three. So we just eleven means three. We just got see there are eleven groups, but there are three people in each group. So eleven times three. You see, I'll show you how it is with eleven times three equal to see. We just going to do it like this. 3 plus 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 3. See. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 plus 3. See. I am just going to add 5. 3 times 5 equal to 15. This 3 times 5 equal to 15. Then. Again I am going to take 5. See. So this equals to 15. 15 plus 15. 10. 15 plus 15, 10 plus 5 plus 10 plus 5, 10 plus 10, 20, 10. But if we add these two, it will become 30. So 30 plus another 3. See, there was a 3 left here. So 30 plus 3 equal to 33. So, 11 times 3 equal to 33. 11 times 3 is 3. 33 or 3 times 11 is 33. So 
Now let's do 12. I'm just going to add one pebble to each group. One pebble to group one. One pebble to group two. One pebble to group three. You see, I'm going to use these cards to represent. There are 12 in group one. 12 in group three. 12 in group two. And 12 in group three. So, there are three 12. That means three times 12. We write it like this. Three times twelve equal to see three times twelve. Twelve plus twelve plus twelve. Ten plus two plus ten plus two plus ten. Plus 10 plus 10 equal to 30. 2 plus 2 plus 2. Means 2 times 3 is equal to 6. So 30 plus 6 equal to 36. So 3 times 12 equal to 36. So you know I'm just going to uh, I'm just going to split everything. I'm separating. See? 3, 3. I'm separating each one. 3, 3, 3, 3. See? I'm going to count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. See? There are 12 groups. But 3 pebbles in each group. So 12 times 3. See, we write it like this. 12 times 3 equal to. See. 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. Represent there are 13 in group 1, 13 in group 2, and 13 in group 3. See, there are 3 30s, means it's 3 times 13. Now, let's do 3 times 13. 3 times 13 equal to, see, 3 times 13 equal to 13 plus 13 plus. 30 10 plus 3 plus 10 plus 3 plus 10 plus 3 see 10 plus 10 plus 10 30 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 see that equals to 9 30 plus 9 equals to 39 
So three times thirteen is thirty-nine. So now I'm going to split it. See, I'm going to split all of it into three groups. See, I'm just going to split all the pebbles into three groups. Thirteen groups in each group. There is three, three pebbles. So now there are thirteen groups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10 11 12 13 so there are 13 groups so 13 times 3 then we have to add 3 13 times but i want i don't want to do this guys i request you to add it and uh, you should get 39 because 3 13 times 3 equal to 39 and 3 times 13 also equal to 39 14. We are going to add one to each group. One more to group one, one more to group two, and one more to group three. So I'm going to use these cards to represent that there are 14 in group one, 14 in group three. So there are three 14s. Meaning 3 times 14. I write it like this. 3 times 14 equal to. So, see. 14 plus 14 plus 14. 10 plus 4 plus 10 plus 4. Plus 10 plus 4. 10 plus 10 plus 10 equal to 30. Then 4 plus 4 plus 4 equal to. See, 3 times 4, that equals to 3 times 4. That equals to 4 plus 4, 8. 8 plus 4 equal to 12. So, 3 times 4 equal to 12. 30 plus 10, 40. But 40 plus 2, 42. So now, 3 times 14 equal to 42. Now, let me split it. See, I am going to split everything into 3 whole groups. In one group, three in two groups. Do you get it? There is I'm going there are 14 groups in that there are three pebbles each. See. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. See, there are fourteen groups and three pebbles in each group. So, fourteen times three. So, fourteen times three and three times fourteen equal to forty-two. See? 14 times 3 equal to also 42. Now let's do 15. I'm just going to add 1 to each group. So I'm going to use these 
card to represent there are 15 in group 1, 15 in group 2, 15 in group 3. There are 3 15s, meaning 3 times 15. 3 times 15 equal to 15 plus 15 plus 15. That's 10 plus 5 plus 10 plus 5 plus 10 plus 5. 10 plus 10 plus 10 equal to 30. 5 plus 5 plus 5 equal to 50. 30 plus 50. 30 plus 10 equal to 40. 40 plus 5 equal to 45. So, 3 times 15 equal to 45. 15 times 3 and 3 times 15 both equal to 45. Let me just split it. Split it. There are 12, there are 15 groups and 3 pebbles in each group. You know what I am doing? You see, the left ones I am keeping here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So there are fifteen groups and there are three pebbles in each. So fifteen times three and three times fifteen both equal to forty five. Now let's start sixteen. I'm just going to add three to each group. 1 to group 1, 1 to group 3, and 1 to group 3. I'm going to use these cards to represent that there are 16 in group 1, 16 in group 2, and 16 in group 3. See, there are 3 16s, meaning 3 times 16. 3 times 16 equal to 16 plus 16 plus 16. 10 plus 6 plus 10 plus 6 plus 10 plus 6. 10 plus 10 plus 10 equal to 30. 6 plus 6 plus 6. You know 3 times 6 is equal to uh, 18, right? So 30 plus 10, 40. 40 plus 8, y8. So 3 times 16 equal to 48. 16 times 3 and 3 times 16 equal to 48. So now I'm going to split it. See, there are going to be 16 groups. And three in each group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. See, there are sixteen groups and three pebbles in each group. Sixteen times three also should be forty-eight. So, um, let's start 17. So, I'm just going to add 3, 2. I'm going to add one pebble to each group. So, now I'm going to use these cards to represent that there are 17 in group 1, 17 in group 2, 17 in group 3. See, there are 3 17s. So, 3 times 17. Seventeen plus seventeen plus seventeen. Ten plus seven plus ten plus 
seven plus ten plus seven. Ten plus ten plus ten thirty. Seven plus seven plus seven. Do you know three times seven is equal to twenty one? So thirty. So thirty. Forty fifty. Fifty plus one. So fifty one. Three times seventeen equal to fifty one. Seven times seventeen times three also equal to fifty one. Three times seventeen and seventeen times three both equal to the same answer. Now I'm going to split it up. So you see, there are seventeen groups and three pebbles in each group. So I'm telling is, if we split this, we will get seventeen times three. See, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So there are seventeen groups. Or three pebbles in each group. So seventeen times three. Let's start eighteen. We need to add one to each group. See one one. And I'm going to use these cards to represent that there are eighteen in group one, eighteen in group two, eighteen in group three. So there are three eighteens. Means three times eighteen. Three times eighteen equal to three times eight equal to eighteen plus eighteen plus eighteen. Ten plus eight plus ten plus eight plus ten plus eight. Ten plus ten plus ten equal to thirty. Eight plus eight plus eight. We know three times eight is equal to twenty-four, right? So three plus twenty, forty plus twenty equal to fifty. Fifty plus four, easy fifty-four. So three times eighteen equal to fifty-four. So see, eighteen times three and three times eighteen both should come fifty-four. So here there are fifty four pebbles. I'm just going to split it. I'm going to split fifty four pebbles into eighteen groups. I'm just splitting all of them into three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. See, there are eighteen groups, fifty-four pebbles. Eighteen groups. I'm just giving three pebbles to each group. So eighteen times three, three times eighteen. They both are the same. So now, let let's start nineteen. We are going to add one to each group. See, we are going to add one to each. Group. See, I'm going to use these cards to represent. There are nineteen in group one, nineteen in group two, nineteen in group three. There are three nineteen. So three times nineteen. Three times nineteen. Equal to see nineteen plus nineteen plus nineteen ten plus nine plus ten plus nine plus 
10 plus 9. 10 plus 10 plus 10. That equals to 30. 30. 9 plus 9 plus 9. See, 3 times 9, we know it obviously is 27. 30 plus 20, obviously equal to 50. 50 plus 7, 57. 3 times 20, equal to 57. You see, 3 times 19, 19 times 3. Both equal to 57. See, now I don't want to split it. See, normally we know there are going to be 19 groups and 3 groups and there are 3 pebbles in each group. So it's obviously 19 times 3. Now, let us start 20. See, 20. First, I'm going to add 1 pebble to each group. See, 1 pebble to group 1, 1 pebble to group 2, one pebble to group 3. Group 1. Group 2. Group 3. See, we know. So now there are 3 twenties. Meaning 3 times 20, right? 3 times 20 equal to. This one is going to be a lot easy. 20 plus 20 plus 20. 20 plus 20? 40. 40 plus 20? Equal to 60. So, 3 times 20 equal to 60. 20 times 3? 3 times 20. Both equal to 60. Thanks for watching. Please practice daily. Bye-bye.